I really hoped that I could bring you some good news today. Other than I hope you're having a blessed day. I hope that you're staying prepared, that you're prepping today so you're prepared for tomorrow because more closures are happening. People are being laid off. Communities are losing grocery stores. They're losing pharmacies. They're losing banks. We are losing a lot of things. These companies will go on. They will continue to profit at the cost of us. They will move in and they will push everything else out of that community. And then when they're done and we're not doing enough for them, they leave. Let's talk about it. What's up fam? Welcome back to Tommy's Carolina Homestead. Just a quick video to let you know, you guys, things are not calming down. More locations for banks, grocery stores, pharmacies are closing. Today we're discussing pharmacies that are closing. Rite Aid is set to close three locations. One has already shut down as of Thursday and the others will follow can please watch it to the end because it does help this channel and share it out with family and friends and subscribe to the channel if you have not we would love for you to become one of our family members which i call cousins and if you did already welcome cousin a spokesperson for the right aid has confirmed that three stores in western new york are set to close two of the stores are in buffalo and one is in niagara falls here are the three locations. Before we get into the locations, give this video a thumbs up. Please share this video out. Let people know so they'll see that these things are continuing to happen. Nothing is going back to normal. Even though these places are closing, they are leaving huge holes in the community, but they are leaving huge discounts on their way out the door. So take advantage of those discounts. You will see in this video, this woman, she took advantage. She wasn't able to find anything, but like Valentine's Day things. But if you can find out about these closings and where they are in enough time, rather, you have time to go out, stockpile your medications or whatever it is that you're, you'll be needing for your home. And like many businesses that close, they do give a statement um, letting you know that they put a whole lot of effort into figuring out which stores should close underperforming stores will be closing and that they will do their best to find positions for those employees at other locations not everyone will be able to of course find a job there um is as vacancies are available and that they will be helping customers transfer their prescriptions to either another right aid which is over a mile away um or a different pharmacy so the first location is 1717 Pine Avenue in Niagara Falls. Last date of business, May 4th. 1625 Broadway in Buffalo. Last date of business, May 8th. 291 West Ferry Street. Last day of business, May 11th. I hope this video was helpful and useful. I tried to make it as short as I can. Please watch it to the end because it does help this channel and share it out with family and friends and subscribe to the channel. If you have not, we would love for you to become one of our family members, which I call cousins. And if you did already, welcome cousin. Welcome to the family. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I love you, but God loves you more. He created only one you. Be the best you that you can be. And when you are, go out and spread God's love. Peace, love, and light. Thanks for being here on Tommy's Carolina Homes. This video is being used for copyright disclaimer under 107 of the Copyright Act 1976. Made for fair use for a purpose such as criticism, comment, news reporting, teaching, scholarships, and research. Fair use is permitted by copyright statute that otherwise might be infringing nonprofit, educational, or personal Tips use. Tips the balance in favor of fair use. Rite Aid closing three stores in Western New York. Michael Schwartz spoke with people in one neighborhood who will now be at least a mile from the nearest pharmacy. 
Shelves are bare inside the Rite Aid on West Ferry Street, which will close its doors next Thursday. Crazy because there's not, it won't be nothing here no more. Lauren John Pierre tells me it's discouraging for his community. He walks seven blocks to get his medications here. I've been dealing with this Rite Aid for a long time. You know, I think it's very inconvenient. Soon, he'll be paying for a bus ride to get to a pharmacy, or he tells me he'll have his medicine delivered. You have to go elsewhere. You know, to get your medicine at another pharmacy. The closest pharmacies from here happen to be Rite Aids, but all more than a mile away. We have one in Connecticut, but it's not, it's not here. Deborah Sutton, who lives nearby, was scoring deals in the closing sale. Many things marked 70% off. I got all the Valentine items. I'm set. I'm set. <laughs> but the discounts are bittersweet. So this is not just another store closing. No, it's not. It's our community going down. Rite Aid at 1717 Pine Avenue in Niagara Falls already closed its doors Thursday, and Rite Aid at 1625 Broadway in Buffalo will close on Monday. A Rite Aid representative tells me, we review every neighborhood to ensure our customers will have access to health services, be it at Rite Aid or a nearby pharmacy. The representative added Rite Aid looks to transfer prescriptions to other pharmacies with no issues and strives to transfer associates to other Rite Aid locations where possible. Again, don't wait until it's your neighborhood pharmacy or your neighborhood grocery store or your neighborhood bank. Start prepping today. Stockpile as much as you possibly can when you possibly can. I know things, inflation is crazy out here. We're paying more for every single thing, whether it's putting air in your tire. Yeah, you're paying more for that now. You're not paying that quarter you used to pay or whether you're paying more, um, at your doctor's offices. Things are going up. We have to be preparing. I expect the economy to be this way and get even worse all the way to the end of this year. And then we can reassess and see where we're going. But right now, we're in that recession mode and we need to be stockpiling like our elders did when they, when they went through the Great Depression. Don't let them fool you on the news and tell you everything is okay. It is not, because on the news, all they're covering is uh, Trump's trial. And maybe every now and then, they'll talk about something to do with Russia. Um, like right now, Russia is saying that the U.S. is behind the whole drone attack. So that puts us in a whole nother situation, but that's a whole nother story for another day. Get stocked up. Again, prep today so you're prepared for tomorrow. I watch you as you drive. Do you know I'm looking? And I can't help but smile Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on I put my feet up And we just sing along And I can't help but feeling Just loving this moment Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment Can we stay here together? I could stop the time, don't you know that I would? Cause I'm just loving this moment Can we stay here forever? Forever 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 I watch you as you sleep You don't know I'm looking with you everything's complete Do you know how much I love you? I put your favorite song on 